I'll be telling you how you can do your facial right at home. So all you have to do is grab these items and get started. First, let's start by wearing a headband and keep our hair at the back. I've already cleansed my face and so I will begin with the process right away. However, if you want, then you can go ahead and uh, use a face wash or you can just wipe your face with the help of a wet tissue. So I will wipe my face again just to show you. So first we'll take the cleanser and go ahead with step 1. I'm using this facial kit by Nature's Essence which comes in a lot of varieties such as gold facial, diamond facial, brightening facial, pearl facial etc. You can go ahead and buy this one as it's quite affordable or you can choose a lot of options that are available online and offline. So I'll get ahead with this, uh, I'll take the cleanser on my hand and then start massaging it over my face. You will need a small quantity of the cleanser, then you can add a little more if you need. So I'll just uh, apply it all over my face. Then I'll take a little water, dampen my hands, rub them together. You have to follow inward circular motions for the cheeks. This will lift the cheekbones and make your cheeks look plumper. Then we'll slide up to the forehead and massage like this. Again in circular motions. You can also follow motions like these which help in scrubbing and uh, removal of all the dead skin. Continue massaging till the product gets absorbed. Now I'm done massaging for a while and now I will take this uh, wet tissue, dip it in the water and then remove all the cleanser that is there on my face. So now I'm done removing the cleanser. I will now move on to step 2. Now I'll take the massage cream and then start massaging. Be very gentle in this approach and keep massaging slowly onto your skin while feeling that relaxation and the wearing off of the dullness of the skin. Now keep massaging for a while, following the similar patterns of uh, massage motions that we showed you earlier. I'll also spread the cream to my neck and in upward motions. Now that the cream has already gotten absorbed into my skin, I will move to step 3. Step 3 is the application of the glow pack. So I'll take the pack on my hands. Now I have the glow pack on my hand. You can apply it with the help of a face pack brush or even your fingers. All you have to do is dampen your fingers and add a little water. You can also use rose water instead. The pack has now become quite flowy and I am ready to apply it. Spread it evenly onto your face. Avoiding all the places where your hair is, such as the eyebrows and above the ears. Even if the pack gets applied on the hair, it won't matter as much, but you have to avoid applying it on the hair. 
So you have to apply this pack in the upward direction to lift the face. Now the leftover pack, I'll apply it on my neck. Once you are done spreading it all over your face and neck, then let it stay on for about 10 to 15 minutes. Let it dry and you'll be done. As a part of the tip, when you apply the pack, you don't have to speak much. All you have to do is lie down and relax and calm yourself down so that the, you know, the skin does not get wrinkles. The, the pack shouldn't get wrinkles while you have it on. So now my face pack has dried. I will remove it with the help of this facial brush. If you do not have a facial brush, then you can simply massage it with your fingertips and remove the face pack. So I'll dampen the brush a little bit and then start massaging onto my skin. Now I'll show you how you can massage and remove it. Dampen your fingertips and massage like so. Now take a tissue and dip it in water. Ring it a little and you will be able to remove the pack easily now. So now I'm done removing the pack and we will move on to the last step which is applying the polishing cream and making our skin look perfect. This is the final massage before your facial is done. Keep massaging till the cream gets absorbed into the skin and once you're done, you can rinse your face once because you might feel some granules of the scrub left over onto your skin. So my scrub was step one itself. The cleanser included the scrub granules and uh, my step one was scrubbing itself. So then it was massaging. Step number three was pack and step number four is the polishing cream which will eventually make my skin glow brighter. So my skin is cleansed and all the dead skin particles have been removed. I'll just rinse my face once and then I'll show you the end results. So now I've rinsed and pat dried my face and you can see how cleansed and beautiful my face is looking. My skin is feeling very smooth and soft and if you too want to do your facial right at home, then you can just follow these steps and do it for yourself.